You're the type of boss I want to be when I grow up. Aren't you wise? Hey, man, huh? Huh? Who's bad, huh? Oh, let me tell you, you are in for a treat. The Prince of Detroit, starring Detroit's own Tommy Duncan. It's out right now. Guess what? Here in studio to tell us all about it, we have Tommy Duncan and Tommy the Third. Welcome. Welcome to you both. Okay. Okay, uh, I'm going to start with you. Uh, give us just a little synopsis. Well, I would say of the movie, but this is of your life. <laughs> yes, it is. Yeah, so it's about a black family yeah. here in Detroit mm -hmm. that through the 90s did something extraordinary. Yeah. They bought a hospital, bought an insurance company, and my mother led it, and she was a single mom, and so she was my best friend, and I was long for the ride. And you were able to turn this into quite the family business. Mm -hmm. um, you sold it for how much? $120 million. All righty then. And it doesn't stop there. Several businesses after that. Uh, but when they make this movie about your life, of course you say, well, who's going to play young Tommy? It's mm -hmm. got to be your son, right? Naturally. <laughs> yeah. How was it to be in a movie? And by the way, you did a great job. And this is not just a little, a little cameo. You are in right. the whole movie. A lot of lines. Yeah. Talk to me about that process. What was it like? Uh, well, he asked me to do it. Uh, it was really fun. Yeah. It was fun being him because, you know, I'm the updated version. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Star you know, for I just, sure. I took it on as my first time. Mm -hmm. So hopefully I did good. Yeah. Well, I, th I think I killed it, you know. I know you Especially killed it. Especially in that fighting scene. Listen. Man, I just hope the writers wrote that, like, I won because I was getting slapped <laughs> back. And it was terrible. I didn't like that part. You had this epic fight with Columbus Short. Yeah. You have Dame Dash and your dad directing because this is your dad's real life yeah. experience. Was it a surprise to you to, to really understand in this way when you see it in film what your dad went through? the business acumen that your grandmother had and all that they built. I mean, really a yeah. legacy here in Detroit. I mean, for my grandma, I didn't know any yeah. of this until the movie came out. Wow. I just like ate pancakes and stuff. <laughs> I, I didn't know. Yeah. For my dad, I didn't know really either. Mm-hmm. But so it was good to like learn about, about it. What is it like for you to work with Dame to, and then for you also to be an executive in this film? And I mean, this is your family story. Yeah. So I know you can't really have somebody else saying, oh, I like this better. Cause this right. is your mother we're talking about. Oh, I know, yeah. I know. It was crazy because for like 20 years, I wanted to write the story. Yeah. But I didn't have the money to produce it yet. Then when I got the money, I met with Dame and within 30 minutes of us meeting, of us meeting each other, mm -hmm. he wanted to go ahead and do the movie. So we went from meeting each other to doing a movie together. Yeah. Just like that. What does that say about all that your family was able to accomplish? You know, it's phenomenal. Because yeah. when you live it, then it's your experience. Mm -hmm. You don't see how big of a deal that it is until mm -hmm. someone else, and then someone like Dane with his experience, thinks so highly of it, it was like, wow, this is really something to do. Can I, I and then there's not a lot of this in the movie yet. I know there are, there are more coming, but one of the things that sticks out to me, I mean, your family is gorgeous. Your wife, unbelievably beautiful. And the way that you gush about her, we were at the movie premiere uh, this weekend, mm -hmm. and uh, you just have to be so proud. Yeah, I'm proud and I'm lucky. Because <laughs> I'm lucky enough, stunning. I found, yeah, the most beautiful woman I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. When I saw her, I was, Shell shocked, starstruck. <laughs> this was freshman year of college. Actually, before we started freshman yeah. year, I saw her through someone. And I just fell in love immediately. But she didn't date me at first. Mm -hmm. I kept trying for five years. But after we graduated, my mother yeah. reconnected us. Really? Believe that? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. And I know you come back to the city all the time. Uh, Advice, I'm sure people are always saying, how, how can I be like you? You are from Detroit and you did it. Yeah, you gotta have some hustle muscle. Yeah. That's what it's all about. <laughs> That's the line in the movie, y'all. That's what it is, right? So education is a large part of it. You gotta have, you know, some know-how. Mm -hmm. But beyond that, you just have to have hustle muscle. You gotta have that work ethic. You gotta have perseverance. Go out and get it and just keep going. So awesome to have you both in studio. I know we're gonna be seeing a lot more of you guys and especially you yep. young superstar. He said he's the upgraded version. Yep. I, I didn't have anything to do with that. I don't know what's going on. See, I thought he was a knock off the knock off. <laughs> but uh, he could go. be right. <laughs> we will see. For more information, by the way, you guys have to check out this movie. It's playing where? AMC Theaters, John R. Great Lakes. In a form third. Well, you might be. See, there you go. He got you again. Yep. Quick break. We'll be right back. <laughs>